Here's your warning for graphic and adult language is used in this video as we make complete idiots of ourselves and fail miserably in checking our hive. Public service announcement, when checking a hive, don't be too cool to smoke. Always smoke the bees before disturbing them. We genuinely hope you laugh as hard at our expense as we did watching the video afterwards. Hey, can you hold this? Wait. It says Joe's do not touch. They're still very active that? bees. Oh, better hope I don't get any crap inside of here. Mm, you better hope you don't piss them off enough to sting me. <laughs> I'll say like Xavier did on the last video. You get me stung, I'm going to throw you into the bees. This thing, you, it's your fault because you're not suited up. Okay, I guess I'm ready for that knife back, please. Oh, you need the knife? Yeah, without stabbing me. It would be nice. It is about 20 minutes and 9 in the evening. Joe is going to go in and he's going to do a hive check. This is the first one that we have done since we put that third box on, right? Yeah. No, since we put the second box on, you just set the third one on. Yeah, we haven't checked the hive since we put the honey zipper on. Okay. And nothing. Well, there shouldn't be nothing in there. I know. It's a joke. You have a hole in your suit. Hey, there's one. Where? Right there at your left hip. You better hope a bee don't find that hole. No, you better hope a bee don't find that hole. You'll see me run like a little baby. <laughs> I didn't smoke them, so you might want to step back. Why didn't you bring the smoker? Because there was no point in it. I'm hyped up. I'm suited up. Well, good for you. Oh. Okay, so they're in the honey super. Absolutely. Oh, they are building comb up there, aren't they? Yep. No point in pulling any of that apart. Yeah, they're not happy. You probably want to step back. Well, I mean, the zoom's only so great. You really should have brought the uh, smoker. But as you can see, there's a little more than a... Yeah, that's got honey in it. Does it? Oh, yeah. Nice. Do we want to check this one, or do we want to just go down to the brood? Well, lift one out of that one and see what it's doing. Because that's their, that's their winter honey. And I'm actually sort of happy that they're attacking me right now. Why, because it because proves the that suit works? That, that tells me that they are a protective hive. I don't see anything on that. I still have not gotten to the outside frames of that. But, I could... There's not that many of you on me. There's a lot on you. I can tell you that they've gotten to the center hives. Frames? Or the center honeycombs. I am slowly backing away. What? I have one over here. Oh yeah, they're not happy. If I put this out to normal zoom, uh, that's about where I am. That's about like the accurate distance that I am. Woo.
That's a lot of bees. We're going to call it for... I would, say, I would say the queen's still alive. Ooh, not in my hair, not in my hair, not in my hair. Please, not in my hair. I can't, it's in my fucking hair. Okay, so I'm now up on the porch. I have retreated to the house. I finally got the two bees that were up in my hair out. And I don't know why they don't like me. Joe is over here walking around trying to get the bees to leave him alone. And he's all suited up. He's going back the uh, side of the property. Joe, what's wrong? What? What's wrong? Oh, well, one of them got me in the wrist. Okay. Do you think maybe you should have smoked them first? Are you all right? You're not allergic, right? No, I'm just making sure that no more drug There's like four that have already tried to get me to the end. Okay. Because once they sting you, they release the pheromone and they try to continue to get you like that motherfucker just did there. <laughs> that arm. Cocksucker, now I've been gotten in both wrists. <laughs> Well, he done pissed off the bees hard tonight, so um, I don't know what we're going to do for tonight. You know, everybody says that you have to do hive checks, and as Joe pointed out, nobody checks the natural hives out in the wild hanging in trees, so... I don't know how much we actually need to check the hives or if that's just another human imposed situation that's really not necessary. But we'll get the hive put back together. Maybe it'll be dark when we do it and I'll come out and hold a flashlight so he can yell at me for holding the flashlight wrong. I'm not really sure, but at some point in time, the hive needs to be put back together because it's been completely dismantled. You can see. Oh, no, I got the cover on it at least. Okay, you can see that it is well bearded and they are still flying like crazy. They've got Joe stung multiple times. They tangled up in my hair and I was 25 feet away um, and wasn't even moving. So they're just definitely not a super friendly hive. But is this a bee or a fly? I, I'm hoping that they're at least going to produce some honey. <laughs> 